I'm cooking now. You know why? So picture this. My wife jetted off to Korea for some eye surgery. Your wife left you? Yeah, my wife left me. Yep. She decided to spice up her life by adding a little overseas adventure. And why? You ask? Well, one day, out of the blue, her eye decided to play hide and seek with her vision. Turns out it was all about retinal detachment. Fancy medical lingo for, oh ho, eye emergency. So she hopped on a plane, landed in Korea on Saturday. In Korea. And boom, she was in surgery by Monday. Eye surgery. Now they are telling us she might be hanging out in Korea for a good five to six months, getting treated in all that jazz. And all that jazz. And that, my friends, is how I found myself back to solo living after a solid decade. So here I am, a Korean dude in a good US of A, rediscovering how to adopt alone. Home alone too. Today's adventure, whipping up some Korean style zucchini pancakes. Zucchini? Let's be real, it's not because I'm craving these pancakes. It's because my fridge decided to throw moldy party with the zucchinis. Cooking, it's not just about the munchies. Folks, I've learned that it's also about saving those poor food ingredients that are on the brink of becoming Triskin casualties. Now, the Korean style zucchini pancakes are as simple as it gets. I rummaged through my pantry, found three different kinds of flour. I decided, what the heck? and mixed them all together. Then came salt, eggs, vegetable oil, and dash of water. Grease up the pan and slap that batter on some zucchini slices. And voila! voila. Turns out, my zucchini is ripe for the picking, and I couldn't resist nibbling on a pancake dip in soy sauce. Koreans do it that way, you know? But honestly, it didn't exactly hit the taste board jackpot. Sorry, honey. If I ever said your cooking wasn't top notch, zucchini pancakes are just tricky like that. Sorry, honey. But fear not. I took matters into my own hands. Threw in some brown sugar, red pepper powder, balsamic vinegar, and sesame oil. Oh, and I went wide and added some sparkling water. Trust me, it was a game changer. The result? Deliciousness. So, who knew? Maybe I've got a secret talent for cooking after all. Top Chef! Top Chef is the best! <laughs> I've been in America for a cool 13 years now. My permanent resident in 6 and became a full-fledged citizen in 12. Worked my tail off for one company all the time. But last year, they gave me a boot. Fire! Fire! And then, just to keep things interesting, my wife decided to glove trot for eye surgery. This has me reminiscing about the tough time we've weathered together. And I gotta say, I'm feeling pretty grateful. Thank you, honey. Now, for the next six months, it's just me, myself, and I. Here in the States, no job, no wifey. And let me tell you, without her, I've got more than enough time to spend on food. Like, more than 30% of my day is all about grow up. So, what else am I gonna do? With my newfound free time, well, I'm diving headfirst into studying AI. No, study, study. Plus, I'm curious as heck about what life's gonna look like for a Korean dude suddenly flying solo in a good old US of A. But, hey, let's keep our fingers crossed that 
My wife's eyes bounce back, good as new, and she's back on America soil in a jiffy. Until then, stay tuned for more wild adventure of a Korean guy trying to adult alone. <laughs>